It's been a while. It's been a very long time since I've last recorded a video in the Wild West. I don't know how long, but it's easy to check. But, um, wait, do I might not sound... Alright, I do, because, uh, last time, I, I keep saying this, but when I did my auction house video, I got copyrighted because of, apparently, song stolen from someone. But anyway, I just want to quickly point out that this gun that, you know, I have to do a review on, look how much it's going for. I'm not grinding that much. It's, I'll wait till it's, like, dead in the water. But anyway, so this video's title might con might convince some of you that I'm quitting. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. It's fine. All right. I'm still playing this game. It's just when the content drops. At some point, it's it's bound to drop. All right. But uh, the thing is, all right, is that we don't. The state of the game currently isn't looking too well. I did one of these videos for the Thunderbird in Mad City, and uh, if you know from that video. This video, now thing is right, I, someone had been called out and pretty much smack talked for complaining about the update and stuff not coming out. This is just talking about the current state of this game and what could happen if something doesn't drop. Well, actually, thing is right, is that this game probably won't die of just being in a dormant state because as I'm recording, let me quickly refresh my screen. Okay, that's not what I wanted to click. This, and refresh my screen, which you can't see, it currently has... 2,177 players currently active, which still isn't bad. There are games that are, you know, a actively updating, which get less. Okay, why are you not stupid? Why is this horse? Come on, dude. Okay, for some reason the horse is being stupid. Come on. God, oh, wouldn't sprint. All right. But anyway, do you work now? There we go. All right. But anyway, anyway. So it's still, the game isn't dead. If it was dead, it'd be less than a thousand. You know, if it, that'd be categorized as starting to die and then be dead would be like zero players. But, uh, you know, still the game does well, but it just hasn't got any content. And the thing is, all right, is that the last update was a very small update. Now the thing is, all right, is that this will sound like complaining later or kind of like make that another statement I'm gonna make sound relevant, but I'll start off with that, right? So basically, there is no content coming to the game, and you know, not not even a drip feed of content, right? Because they were saying that we'd done really small updates, maybe every few weeks. Nothing, nothing has happened since, you know, the uh, Admiral Axe gun, which, to be honest, is a pretty bad way. I've heard pretty bad stuff about it. That it, it's not a bad gun, probably in the right hands. But again, it's still probably really crap. Pretty much what they've done is they added a new gun and they've revamped this with like... I think that terrain's different. That's definitely different terrain. And this. Flowers. And I didn't want to make a video on it because I didn't have the gun. Nor do I care about flowers. I mean, the flowers are cool. To be honest, these flowers are really cool. Right? And they have a bit more atmosphere and a bit of whatever. But anyway, um... Thing is, alright, is that there's another game currently having a drip feed, and it's got, like, minimal content, alright? And that's GTA V. As you know, they always drip feed content, and this is no particular. They give a, they would give the players a small amount of content, and go, here you go. Survive, like, three weeks off it. You have a month to that, to like, a week or two, and that's all the content you get. Like, a few cars, and that's it. But, but, this game could do that and drip feed some content. There is some content that has probably been ready... And this is the thing that got the other guy in trouble, is that he was complaining that there's content, why isn't it coming out? The thing is, right, is that I... doesn't matter if it comes out or not, it's just, you know, if this game wants to be more popular, content has to drop, right? And they you know, stuff like the building update, I don't know if the building update has been done, but, you know, the thing is, right, the main reason I'm saying to drip feed some of this, even like with the update, instead of launching everything at once, drip feed content over, a, like, a few weeks, right? So first you might do the Game Pass guns, then the building update, and then the progression system, and heist revamps. Like, it doesn't matter what order, but just drip feed it, because the thing is, if you put all this into one big update, it's going to be extremely confusing for players to be like, what do I do now? And for me, for a content creator, I'll be like, what do I do? Like, what do I do, alright? Like, what, co what, what bit of content do I do first? Progression system? Do I look at the heist revamps? Do I look at literally anything else? I don't know. Like, it... You see where it is, like, you have no starting point for this. It's just going to be confusing for players, and they're going to be all over the place, right? Instead of, you know, people focusing on a building update when it's been drip-feeded, you know, and everything just dropping at once, it's just... 
it's just, you know, it's going to be confusing when the big update comes out, you know, and there's so much things you can do, which is going to be exciting and get all players hyped up for months about all this cool stuff that's dropped, but it just makes no sense why you would drop everything at once. Another game has recently got an update, and I still haven't recorded a video on it, is Mad City. It's dropped Season 2 along with a Christmas update, which is a spelling for disaster, because you can be like, i got to grind the presents, but the Season 2's out, and I want to get the vehicle as soon as possible. You get what I mean? I think it's alright, it's about priorities, alright? It's about what do I do first, what do I prioritize as the thing I'm going to do first, alright? You know? But still, back to the state of the game, alright, is that... Actually, that's pretty much the whole point, alright? The pretty much whole point of this is that launching everything at once will make it, you know, confusing, alright? You know. The thing is, right, is that for stuff like the Game Pass guns, they're probably already done by now, and they could be drip-feeded to us as a next update, right? They could be given to us, and they'll be give us happy for a little bit, you know? The Mauser... I think the uh, Pirates Game Pass is going to get a new gun along with the Golden Dragoon. The, um, what's its face? Uh, the Silenced Hammerless, alright? Yeah, I knew that was going to happen. Alright, just uncall that one. Uh, but anyway, um, so they could, they could, that's an option. They could give us some content via that instead of adding a whole new gun, which is pretty much like, it's just, I don't know, it's basically like the old Spitfire, except one bullet and a stupidly long reload, alright? You know, it's just that when they drip feed us content, they gave us one gun and some bushes. And that's pretty much so like, yep, that's your update. And still, to this day, it has not done anything. I presume that was months ago when that last updated. Um, probably now have been bug fixes and stuff. But, you know, it's just that... It's just, it feels like I'm repeating myself over and over again. It's just really hard to make content on the game that has nothing to make content on. I've done reviews on pretty much almost all the guns. The only gun that I haven't got a review on is that, um, the Ammo Axe gun. As you saw, it was $600,000. I'm not wasting my time grinding that amount of money when I can wait a few months, probably to when the update's finally dropped, make money via that, and then just build the, buy the gun. Because people are going to be focused on all the other crap. They're not going to be like, Oh, the Admiral Axe gun. Actually, no, they will. They will. When the update drops, everything spikes in price. Because everyone's like, I want some new guns because the game just... I just started the game up again. You know, the, the, thing, the stuff spikes. But thing, even months. It's probably been at least a month since that gun's dropped. It's still in a high amount of money, alright? You look at every other gun, the prices aren't that good. Like, let's just look at the auction house really quick, you know? The thing is, alright, is that you'd think it'd be dead by now. Pretty much, no one would be buying these guns at such a high price. I mean, at some point, they're bound to just dip in price. I mean, that they're out of the millions, but like... Okay, if you look at all these prices, that's a reasonable amount of price for a gun, alright? You know, this, look, look at that, almost $700,000 for a gun that isn't that good, for a number. They're only doing it for a number, to be honest. Looking at all this other stuff, it's much cheaper than before. So I would presume that now would be the best time to buy something else. I would say grind now before an update drops because task guaranteed that stuff's going to spike up a lot, all right? The Pattersons go up and all that other stuff, they all go up. Anyway, also the Spitfire was removed. That happened months ago at like the Halloween update, you know? Also, you know, let's let's just quickly go over the current updates, the updates that have been recent-ish. So, the thing is, right, if you go over here to this right here, and it actually is telling that October 31st, it's currently New Year's. It's been over two months since that update dropped. Two months since this game has been pretty much got nothing. And we didn't get a Christmas update. See, well, it said something about Christmas here. Here, maybe. If The, the answer is maybe. Yep, maybe, which was a dead no, pretty much, because now there is no Christmas event, there has no... I mean, I understand why they must have been like, yeah, we can't drop an update like that, mainly because Christmas is celebrated by much more people than Halloween, right? Halloween is an American thing, alright? Americans, they send their children out to go out into the world and collect candy from strangers. Christmas is celebrated by a lot of people, right? Celebrated by more people than people who celebrate Halloween. Alright? Only... And, like, for, for I come, Australia, we don't celebrate Halloween. Well, we do. 
But we don't do trick-or-treating and all that crap, right? We don't. Alright, because it's an American holiday. You rarely see any trick-or-treaters out on the street. You never do. You just never do, because why would you celebrate? It's an American holiday. It's not ours, right? It's like celebrating, like, happy Chinese New Year. It's no point. Ah, oh, oh, help. Anyway, yeah. So, the probably reason that Christmas update didn't come is because it was just probably too much work. And there, it, like, there's one dev working on it, I think. One dev working on it. It could be one dev, or it could be another game that I'm talking about, which is now, I think, discontinued. Which isn't good. I'm not going to make a video on that. When that, that final update drops, i got to talk about that game. Because that's a really good game. It's an underrated horror game. Well, actually, it's been played a lot, and it's a really good horror game. But to be honest, I don't know why it hasn't been played more. You know, and also, there's another horror game that I kind of want to play. I've played it before, and it's pretty decent, to be honest. But anyway. Oh, that's, that's just my bit of a rant. Not over. Because, you know, I still got to talk about the previous updates. But that's pretty much it. After that, I'm done ranting and I'm stopped talking. Alright, see? Ha Halloween 2022. Alright, we, we know what added here. We all know. It was basically reskins of these two guns. I mean, it was free Sawnoth, pretty much making the other Sawnoth and the mule irrelevant. Um, let's have a quick squiz at what else. Uh, they added a few rewards like that lantern. Uh, the, the dagger was given back. Whatever. Pretty much nothing was interesting here. Then this, this was 2021, the Christmas update from 2021. All right, but then the thing is, right, it's before the Halloween event, at around September. The thing is, is that this, the last update before the Chris, the Halloween update, was the Christmas revert, where they took everything away from Christmas. Dude, God, it's it's just kind of bad how we have currently last year one update, one update. Technically two, but it's a mini updates and didn't add that much content. You know, if I don't, you know, it's just it's just not really content worthy when they add a gun that I can't obtain because it's stupidly overpriced. Because there's sweats out there who just go, oh, I'm gonna spend every single dollar on this thing. Have you noticed the spike? All right, I've I've done with the main part of the video and pretty much this is the end of the state of this game. That it's 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 pretty bad to be honest because there isn't anything to do. And I am not quitting again because people think when I, I uh, just you know when I expand into other games, people think I'm quitting. You know, for some reason, I am making content in this game. Clearly, the Christmas update came. So yeah, and the Halloween update was pretty much just reused stuff, re-put in. It's, I am complaining about it because to be honest, there wasn't much content worthy. I was gonna make a video on it, but I'm like, there's no point. It's just reskins of guns, and nothing else interesting. Alright, well, did they add another gun? I think I added another gun, but I don't know what gun they added. Actually, I don't think they added a new gun. They just added the... Ugh. Oh, they added just some items. That was pretty much it. Like, if I'm looking over here from my inventory. I can tell that there's nothing interesting here. Also, I'm almost out of storage. I need to buy more storage. These two guns, but they're just reskins. And, oh, the lantern that no one cares about, you know? Yeah, pretty much just nothing interesting they added. It was just nothing. Nothing worth my while, alright? Okay, my horse is over here. But anyway, that's pretty much the end of the video, alright? Me complaining about the game that, you know, I've pretty much made my fan base, alright? <clears throat> I mean, you know, I pretty much made the same thing about the Thunderbird. And pretty much everyone agreed. Because if you don't know Matt City, Thunderbird's been outranked by other vehicles that are just better than it. But still, you know, and this game, I wouldn't say there are other games that, okay, I suck. Why is my camera changed? X, no, which one is it? I want to, I forgot how to change the thing. It should not be on this side. Where is it? It's not B. I'm just clicking every single button. Okay. There it is, X. I clicked X before. It didn't work. Alright. Anyway, yeah, it's just, it's not too good. You know, I, I just don't know what to make. You know, people suggested, or one person suggested funny moments, but the thing is, right, is that you see them so often and they're pretty much cringe and people would assume that I'm making that cringe content. I don't like that cringe content. It's just nothing to do. But anyway, yeah, once content finally drops, I will make a video on it. But as of now, there's going to be nothing. Or maybe out of the blue, I might do a, um... I'm not watching a close eye on the uh, axe gun, but 
you know, maybe the prices will drop. You know, but the thing is, right, is I won't talk about when the prices drop, right? That dude's wanted. Right there. Get him. Get him. Do they missed all my shots. <laughs> Did he drop all his crap? She's dead, don't worry. I claimed his bounty. Yeah. Anyway, I'm done. Alright, I'm done. We had a $58 bounty. I am... Was that even the right guy? Oh, it was this guy. Was that... That was the guy who killed. Wait a minute. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, it was a bear. Alright. Alright, I've... This is a delayed outro. Wait, is this... Is this guy wanted? This dude's probably wanted. Yeet, man. He isn't, surprisingly, but I'm getting wanted. See, I'm, I'm blabbering on. I, this video ended ages ago. Alright, okay, like, alright. Okay, I just want to kill this last hitman. I'll get him to do stuff and... Where's the hitman? Come here. Oh, wait. He's friendly fire. Oh, he's dead. Never mind. Yeet man's dead. Alright. Anyway. Yeah, so that's pretty much the state of this game, alright? It isn't too good, as I've said multiple times. You know, this game, I do like this game, and I do like playing the game, you know, when there's stuff to do. I mean, technically there is something to grind for, but I don't want to grind, you know, hours just for a gun that isn't that good, and pretty much isn't going isn't gonna to replace any of my other existing guns, because this is my setup. It's the setup I've used for ages, alright? It's a setup that I spent hours getting, alright? And I will not change it, because I just can't be bothered. Maybe, maybe if the axe gun was a primary weapon, I probably would switch it out for the Spitfire. But right now, I spent hours on the Spitfire, and I'm going to use it. I don't care what people say about the Spitfire. You know, yes, you know, if you got to call that I have cancer, whatever, all right? Because I use a gun that doesn't matter. Isn't that good? Doesn't matter. But anyway, you know, people are probably rejoicing that the Spitfire is gone. Because, to be honest, it wasn't really that good of a gun. It was not really that good. If they, maybe if they reduce the bloody recoil, then maybe. But anyway, anyway, back. <laughs> Thank you for watching, and uh, this guy's trying to kill me. Wait, wait. Uh, <laughs> I'm wasting time. Alright. <laughs> Thank you for watching, and goodbye.